What is going on guys? It's your boy Ace Achilles bringing you a nice gameplay commentary. Today we have a nice recovery SD. This is a game battles match with the squad, Reside Gaming, me, Natick, Roper, and I don't know if it was either Assassins or it was Wrestler. It was one of those and uh, yeah, it's a pretty good gameplay. We end up molly whopping them and we lose the actual GB against them because they were just host warriors, but while they were on our host, we showed them what it's like to be a true gamer, and we just molly whopped these kids, and they had no chance against us. And I do fairly well, so I hope you guys enjoy that gameplay. Today we have a few interesting topics. So number one today is 1-25-2015, January 25th. So tomorrow night, 9 o'clock for all the people on the Pacific Standard Time, we have Havoc DLC. Thank you, it has been so long, and I'm just dying for the new DLC. We're going to have some brand new maps and some zombies, which I can't wait to, uh, wait to bring to you guys. And the AE4 is going to be coming out. I totally, like, it was completely, and I was absent-minded that a lot of people still haven't been able to use the AE4 except for when they pick it up. So all of you guys, if you buy the DLC tomorrow or if you have the season pass, you'll have it. And I'm probably going to bring you guys a nice little video of me using it, my best uh, class setup and, like, what modes to play with it. Because it's a very interesting gun and it has, it's really good if you use it in a certain way, but if you don't, it's absolutely terrible. So hopefully I can help you guys become better with it. Today is the last day of Double XP weekend, if you didn't know already. There's a comeback 24-7 playlist as well. I try to get you guys some gameplay on that, but it is like, if you guys want to play with the sweatiest of the sweatiest, you better jo uh, jump in there right now and you <laughs> you'll know what I mean by the end of it. Next up. The new Call of Duty has been leaked, so I believe it was in, no, it was Treyarch who leaked a picture, and it, uh, it was coded in Morse code, and it actually spells out to World War II, so the next Treyarch game is actually going to be a World War II era, which completely, like, m is mind-boggling to me, because we've traveled all the way back from there, and we're all the way in the future now, so are we going to drop all of the new EXO movements and stuff? I know the graphics will still be really good. But it's like I feel we're stepping backwards, and I love MW, I love uh, World War II era, but I don't want to lose the EXO jump and every. Oh, I don't know about the EXO jump, but like I feel we've made so much progress, and a lot of it's going to be lost. And we're going to be kind of put back to the basics. So hopefully they do a good job of that. I mean, it's in their hands. Worrying about it isn't going to really change it. And um, that's pretty much that. The only other thing I wanted to talk about was the debate between Drift, uh, between Keemstar and a guy named Zeus on Twitter, and it turned into a YouTube video. If you haven't checked it out already, check it out. But it's a little bit of a sad topic. They're debating about um, the war in Iraq and everything. But um, that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. I think I'm gonna be coming out with a montage eventually, and uh, I'll talk about my opinions uh, about sniping in a later video. But uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, please subscribe to me. I'm almost at 160 subs. And as always, this has been your boy Ace Achilles signing out. Have a good weekend, and prepare for Havoc DLC. Well done, Tetro.